Hello, everybody. Well, this is Sex Talk with Sharonda, and I'm going to give everybody a chance to log on because, of course, I know y'all ready to get this good information that I got, and I'm looking because I want to make sure I don't have any customers coming because, of course, I try to do these videos to give y'all the education, but I still have to do, you know, deal with customers and stuff like that, too. So let me just make sure that I'm logged on with you all. Uh, let's see, cancel that, pull that up. And make sure you all like and share and invite your friends. Because of course, this is all about making sure that everybody's getting knowledge when it comes down to turning up in the bedroom. So I just wanna make sure that I'm pulling it up. So if you got questions, this is where you're gonna send them to and make sure this volume is turned down. See. Giving everybody a chance to get logged in. What's up, Piper? Piper, you know I love your name. I always said if I had a daughter, if I had another daughter, I would name her Piper. I just love the name. Absolutely love it. So, as you can see, I'm wearing my Gap shirt today. If you can't see, yes, all my ladies with Gap, good ass pussy. Yep. Go to the website, go get you one. Or come to the store, come get you one. But if you got that gap, all I want you to do is like give me some emojis, some smiley faces, some something. If you got that gap, hit that like button, hit that love button, hit this, hit something. Let let a motherfucker know. I got good pussy and I'm proud of it. Yes, 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 yes. See, when I'm out and about and I'm in public, I wear my shirts. You know, I wear my offensive shirts. Because, you know, a lot of times they get people attention. They be like, oh, I love your shirt, but I couldn't wear that. Oh, baby, I'm going to rip this shit until I close my eyes. This pussy going to be good till the day I leave here. And the world going to know. You can't, I ain't saying that you're going to be able to sample it. I'm just saying that I know it's good. You know? So, when I come up with these shirt ideas and stuff, you know, I, it's just a certain boldness. You know what I'm saying? And I believe that when it comes down to the bedroom, you got to be confident. How else a motherfucker going to feel your shit good if you don't even feel your shit good? Like, but, you know, that's neither here nor there. So, I had an awesome, awesome weekend. Um, did a lot of family stuff. Uh, then last night, I went to the cut party. Now, this year, I said, you know what? I'm doing more networking this year. I absolutely love the cut party. It was a, a hair and barber uh, industry event. But it was like the... the they know how to party. I'm going to just tell y'all... Um, Irene, I think that's the lady name who did the party. Irene, um, I see scissors or something, whatever. You put together an awesome event. I thoroughly enjoyed myself last night. So, today's topic, I think I got a, enough people that's, that's live now that I can get to talking. Make my clit stand up. Mm, let's talk about that. Make my clit stand up. Now, when I start talking about the clit standing up, everybody get to looking like, it can do that? You motherfucking right, it can do that. It can stand up just like a dick. Let me explain this to you. Anatomy. Every man was first a woman. Let me repeat that. Every man was first a woman. That means that before he had a dick, he had a clip. Mm. We're going to get deeper into this. The only difference is his clit grew into a dick and yours didn't. And you remained female and he became male. So that little clit that's in between your legs, that ain't nothing but a dick that never grew. But guess what? It can get hard too. And it can stand up too. And if you don't believe me, Facebook, they just, you know, um, they limit how much I can show you because I would love to show you an erect clip. I would love to show you an erect clip. But I know if I post up an erect clip, they gonna flag my page and I'm gonna be back in Facebook jail. So if you wanna see an erect clip, Google erect clip and it's gonna blow your mind because you're gonna be like, oh my God, it can do that? Yes, it can. Yes, it can stand up. Yes, it can get hard. So, the name of this show, the, the topic for the show today is Make My Clit Stand Up. How do you do that, Sharonda? 
with proper stimulation. Um, everybody not into toys, okay? Everybody's not into toys. Let me start here. First of all, some of y'all can't see your clip because you got too much hair down there, okay? Let's start there. You can't find the clip because you got that jungle love going on. Motherfucker got to walk through the grass and the bushes and all of this shit just to get to the sweet spot. Ladies, I can't say that all men like to shave, but I'm going to tell you most men that I know, they like you to trim that thing down a little bit, if not shave. Personally, I don't want nothing there. I don't I I'm I want to be like I was when I came into the world. Like I don't like all that hair. So, the first thing I'm going to talk about is coochie. Coochie. Coochie is a rash-free shaving cream. What do you mean? Meaning that it is designed for people who have extremely sensitive skin and every time they shave, they feel like I itch, I uh I bump up uh you know, I'm red, I'm irritated. What coochie does is it locks the moisture in the hair follicles so that when you're shaving, it's a moisturizing shave, okay? When the hair starts to grow back, the moisture has been locked in the hair follicle. So when it starts to grow back, because believe it or not, the day you shave it is the day it starts to grow back. It's growing, it's itching because it's growing back and all of that kind of stuff. When it starts to grow back, you don't even know that it's growing back because the moisture is locked into the hair follicle. And the hair is going to grow back and you're not going to experience the redding, the itching, the scratching and all of that. We sell a lot of coochie during the summertime because people go swimming and they want to make sure that they shave in that bikini area. Because some of y'all want to shave around and don't want to shave the, the cat and I don't understand. But yeah, get rid of that jungle love because the motherfucker don't mind going downtown. But they want to go downtown where the streets clean it. So clean the streets up downtown. Okay? So... Now that we didn't got the housekeeping part out the way, and now that we can actually see the clip, because some of y'all, you can't even see the clip. So now that we can see it, let's talk about some things that we can use to make it stand up. The clip, like anything else, can be aroused, and when it's aroused, it uh, becomes erect, okay? Now, it's different things that you can use to arouse it. Now, we got uh, one product called On. Now, if you look at On and you look at this one, this is like twice the size as this bottle, okay? This is like twice the height. So, yeah, you're going to spend like $40 for own, whereas you're spending like, you know, $15, $20 for Crazy Girl. Now, own is all natural, okay? It's an arousal cream that's all natural. These motherfuckers, if he like coffee, <laughs> we got coffee cake. We can give him that coffee cake in the morning before he go to work. And he can wake your clit up and you can wake him up all at the same time. Okay? I'm telling you, they got some shit for everybody. If a motherfucker like black coffee and they like the way coffee tastes, motherfucker, I'm going to make the pussy taste like coffee for you. Yes! And, and in the meantime, my clit going to stand straight up. Because what this does is you put a drop on there and it makes the clit stand up. All of the blood rushes to it. And when all of the blood rush to it, it makes the clit get hard. Same thing with the dick. When all the blood rush to the dick, the dick get hard. Same thing with the clit. We got one called Ice. And then we got the natural original flavor. But all of these are all natural. And it's called On. It's designed to turn you on to make your clit stand up. So when you come into the store, I'm letting you know now. Nah, this shit ain't cheap. But it's going to work. I'm letting you know not. It ain't cheap, but it's going to work. Okay? Yes. Thank you, Daddy. Thank you. Yes. For the men that grow facial hair and shave your head. I do have male customers that come in and get coochie to shave their head as well and to shave the hair on their face because they don't want to break out um, with bumps and rashes from shaving. Okay? Thank you so much for putting that out there. Next, we have Crazy Girl, which most people are familiar with. This has been on the market forever. Used to be called Cleopatra Secret a long time ago, but they changed the name. New company, bought the old company. I'll change the name to Crazy Girl. Same great formula, but this has flavor to it, okay? And it makes the clit stand up as well. Next thing I have, which is one of my... Hey, baby. Next thing I have, which is one of my personal favorites, Okay? Orgasmics. Oh, baby, I live by this shit. I live by it. This is clear. It does not have a color. It does not have a taste. Now, some of y'all with men, and these men 
want to feel like they doing it all by themselves. I, I just said, I said that. I said that. Um, but thank you for putting that on there because I addressed it once I saw you put it on there. Um, orgasmics. If you have a man, because some of y'all men don't like the idea, like they be crazy. They don't like the idea of anything turning you on but them. They don't want you using no toys because they feel like, oh, it shouldn't take all of that to get you turned on. I'm the only person that's supposed to be turning you on. No, you can't play with the pussy when I ain't around because I'm the only person that can touch the pussy. No, see, if you got somebody crazy like that, because some of y'all got men that's really crazy like that, get you some orgasmics. It's clear. Just put it on your finger and rub it on the clit. He ain't going to know nothing. He going to think that the clit did all that because of him. He going to think that the clit's so fat and standing up and motherfucker jumping and thriving and skeeting everywhere all because of him. The whole time you using this here to help you out. Because what he don't understand is some women bodies require more stimulation than others. Some women, you know, they don't require a lot of stimulation. They can do it on their own. But some women really need that extra oomph. And all this does is give you that extra oomph. Okay? So this is Orgasmics. And this is like around $20 price range. But I, I have been using Orgasmics for years. And any woman that ever comes to my party that has ever used orgasmics, I always tell the women, that shit right there, see, you can use this in conjunction with your bullet or without your bullet. This shit right here, oh, baby, it make the pussy throw a party all by itself. So you make sure when you using this right here, this here, when you using this, you make sure that you ready to handle business because your body ain't going to wait on you. It's going to start all without you. It's, it's going to be ready to cut up without you. Okay? But that's this orgasmics right here. Make my clit stand up. Let's talk about some more shit that's going to make the clit stand up. Because I ain't even got to the toys yet. Because we got toys too. We got Climax. Yep, you see it. Climax. This has CBD in it. It also has a relaxing component. But it has an arousing component as well. And this is assists with my, my people that smokers that may not be able to smoke on the job and all of that. But you like that feeling of the relaxation from smoking? Get you some Climax High. Okay? This has CBD in it. No THC. Only CBD. All right? We got Climax Burst. I want you to look at it good. Because you see that? You see those little beads? This is a lubricant. As well as an arousal gel. So those beads in there is lubricating you. But see, when y'all get the fucking and it gets start getting hot, them beads start bursting. And if you get the red one, you're going to get the warming sensation. If you get the blue one, you're going to get the cooling sensation. Some people like to combine the two. So you're getting the warming and the cooling at the same time. But all of this helps with arousal. And arousal is what makes your clit stand up. You got to have arousal. You got to be aroused. If you ain't aroused, your clit ain't going to stand up. If you ain't that into him, your clit is not about to respond to him. It's just not about to happen. So we got the warming and we got the cooling. Climax burst. Let's get off into these toys. Okay. The micro mini bullet. Y'all see that? Y'all see how little that is? Y'all see that? Now, a lot of people, when they come in the store, they overlook this bullet because they say it's too small. It's too small. Let me tell you what I love about this bullet. See, the, the clit have folds in it, right? If you ever look at the woman pussy, it look like a flower. It got all kind of creases and crevices. Well, what this does is your regular bullet, your regular bullet, it just lay on the clit. And it stimulates you just by laying on the clit, pressing on the clit, applying pressure to the clit. This little motherfucker here, it gets all in between them creases and them folds. It gets in areas to where that big bullet that just laid out, this get into areas that the regular bullet can't get to. See, with that clit, you can pull the skin back and you can get all up under the skin with this bullet right here. With this little bitty bullet right here. But in order to do that, you got to do it with a small bullet. It cannot be done with a large bullet. Okay? Now, the next thing I have, it gives the feeling, if you like your clit to be sucked, if you like a motherfucker to just get over your pussy with their mouth and just suck and pull on your clit, I got something for you. 
Because see, some of y'all ain't got no men, but you still can get them same sensations. This is the clit pump. The same way the men have a pump, the men have a dick pump. This is a clit pump. And you see that right there? As you can see, this part here is going to go over the hood of the clit. It's going to like right over the clit. That's where you're going to put it. So right. But it's going to pull the whole vaginal opening to the point where it's pulling the clit. You pushing and you pulling and you, you pumping it up. And it's pulling that clit. It's pulling that clit like somebody sucking on it, right? Pulling the clit. Once you feeling like you're about to come, turn this motherfucker on. It vibrates and then it's going to start vibrating on the clit while it's sucking it at the same time. Now you tell me this ain't some amazing shit. <laughs> you better, huh? You better ask somebody. Now we got this one. This here actually goes on the tip of the clip. This one covers the whole clip. Whereas this only suctions the tip of the clip. Okay? And the same thing. You're going to pull, pull, pull this just for the tip of the clip. All right? Turn it on. And once you come into that orgasm, not only is it sucking the tip of the clip, but it's vibrating at the same time. Like, it's, let me tell you something about this industry that I love. I love this industry because it's so broad. It's so many different things that you can get off into. You can get into the romantic side of the industry. You can get into the fetch side of the industry. You can get into the fun side with the toys. It's so many different things that you can get off into. Stop limiting yourself to the basic bullet. Don't limit yourself to the basic bullet. Expand. Add to your toy collection. The reason it's a collection is because you're adding to it. Okay? The last thing I'm going to talk about is the cooling, warming lip balm. Cooling, warming, tingling. You put this on your lips, ladies. He going to say, oh, baby, your lip gloss popping. And you give him a kiss. Now his lips is tingling and cooling and warming. He go down and eat the pussy. Guess what? The pussy tingling, cool, and warming. It's already on your lips when you go to suck the dick. Guess what? Tingling, cool, and warming. So it's completely transferable. Wherever you use those lips is where this is going to go. Okay? That concludes Sex Talk with Sharonda. Um, if you all have any questions, send them at this time. The address of the store. 9789 Florida Boulevard, Baton Rouge, Louisiana, 70815. The number to the store, 225-663-2982. And make sure you visit us on our website, www.theppgstore.com. Two events coming up. April the 7th, I will be downtown at the Best Damn Ladies Night. I'm partnering up with Jeezy All-Star. So make sure you get with Jeezy for tickets. Come party with me. I will have the toy table on deck. Um, and then April 21st, I'm going to be doing This Girl Likes to Ride. That's going to be the theme for the um, cycling event with Go Cruising um, with Kirk. So I'm getting with him and we're putting this event together for the ladies. So um, just stay tuned and you'll be able to go online and make your purchases for everything. www.dppgstore.com. That concludes Sex Talk with Sharonda. I enjoyed y'all. Make sure y'all come get y'all Gap shirts for my ladies who got that good pussy. Make sure you come represent. Come get your shirts. $12.99 at the PPG stuff is already made. Come check us out.